Join us today for a day at sea aboard the Norwegian Joy. We are going to see what kind of adventures we can find, see what kind of drinks we can drink, and what kind of food we can have, including a hibachi meal at sea. Hi, Hi friends. friends. Well, it's morning, day two. We're gonna make our way to the buffet, the garden cafe, grab some buffet breakfast. Get this kid fed, get that kid fed, get this kid fed. Most importantly, get this kid fed. Yeah, I'm grouchy. He's the crankiest. And uh, we'll get on with our day, so come along. Let's go. Up here. Yeah, I'm much more aware of it. Yeah. Oh my god, we got French toast going back right there. Oof. Taylor. Yeah? Did you see those big French toasts? No. They're thick. I won't get one. <laughs> As always, we came to the back of the buffet because there is tons of seating and you get this great ocean view. It's like you're it's like you're flying above the seas. Yeah. Sorta. Of. I got eggs. We've <laughs> got some French toast, some bacon. It looks like it's bananas foster French toast, so that's amazing. Potatoes. Jake got a uh, full English, it looks like. And we're grabbing some food for the baby. Can never really go wrong with a buffet breakfast. He tried to steal my bacon though, which is pretty rude. Um, I don't know. Oh. It's not quite opera. It's like somewhere in between chanting and opera. I don't know exactly. I, th huh? 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 I think I might like it. I'm vibing with it. I mean, that's great. You know, it's chill. It's good morning tunes. We're gonna go explore the ship a little bit. How's that sound? Sounds great to me. All right. This is a first for us. There is a water spout out on the ocean. Okay, we're here, up here on like deck 17 and a half, right yeah. by the raceway behind us. Woo! And um, we just got news that we're not getting to Bermuda tomorrow. There is a low pressure system, the port is closed, we can't get there until Saturday. So we were supposed to have like 36-ish hours yeah, in Bermuda. it was almost two days. It was like a significantly longer amount of time than we would have had with Royal, which was canceled. Because of a hurricane, <laughs> and now there's a low pressure system, so we're not getting in, and we'll be in Bermuda for like nine hours. Yeah, nine, ten hours. We had all of our excursions booked for tomorrow. Yep. We were like, get them all out of the way and then spend the whole second day exploring, so <laughs> all of just, our excursions are trash. There is uh, some something out there saying you guys should not go to Bermuda. Yeah. But we're gonna keep exploring the ship and... Yeah, at least there's a lot on the ship, you know. If we had been on the, the Royal Caribbean yeah. ship, there was a lot less to do. So yeah. There's a lot to do here, so you just get two sea days now instead of... Three, well, sea, three days. sea days. Now <laughs> instead of two. So if you want to learn all about the uh, Norwegian joy, you're in the right place, because we're gonna do it all. Yep. All right. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do that, maybe. Maybe. Yeah. Looks like a good time. I'm a bad driver. <laughs> They are holding us out in this ocean. We're captive. Not so bad. It's not so bad, right? Yeah, lots of food, lots of drinks, lots of beer. But not yet, because yeah. private function, we can't get into District Brew House. 12 seconds later. Hey Jake, what you get? I got beer. All right. This is a Brock Pale Lager. Um, tastes like it. I got a margarita. Of course. 
We're just sitting by the pool. A little bit of pool deck sitting. Having a margarita. Passing some time, met up with the fam. Made, Matt, make some plans for tomorrow and the next day. Matt's taking a nap with grandparents, which is very nice. So we can have some little adult time. And yeah. we're gonna probably, once he's awake, go get lunch somewhere. We passed the local and the line was like insanely long for 11 a.m. Yeah. It is one thing that like these ships are very busy, so expect that because there's four, almost 4,000 people on it, and yeah. you know it is what it is. You if you go in with the mindset that you're gonna have to wait in line and that it's gonna be busy, it's tolerable. Yeah, or just eat it off hours. You know the line was what it was yeah. at 11, but I'm sure at noon it's gonna be double Even, what it yeah, was. Yeah, so. for sure. But. Oh, it looks like we have a band that's going to start up too, so yeah, that's fun. the Julia Hatfield band. Oh, For I now, bet they're country music. Oh yeah, <laughs> you know how we feel about country music. That's okay, it's not a bad day, it's not a bad view. You're going to have a good gosh darn time. We're uh, terrible vloggers yeah. and we just dug in, but we're at the local, which was one of our favorite places on the Encore. And Jake got wings. He actually got two orders of wings because, you know, wings. Wings. He says they're way better than they were in the Encore. They're really good? Bread. They're just, you know, they're just wings. 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 We got nachos, which we have obviously dug into. They're pretty good as well. And I think this fish sandwich is also better than the Encore. Really nice, hot, delicious. We have uh, a Reuben. No, a Reuben? Chicken no, salad. Chicken salad. That looks really good too. Fish and chips, similar to my sandwich, and fries. Fries are my favorite food, and these are very good, and Miles likes them too. So, big thumbs up from us for the local again. But they don't open until 12:30, at least for us Fools. today. Yeah, yeah at least which, today. I don't know what was up with that. Maybe they were changing over from because they do have breakfast. I think that's probably it. So maybe they were changing over from their breakfast at noon. We which are, seems like a weird time to change. We are very early breakfast and early lunch people, so we're in the minority. We understand that. Put your hate in the comments. <laughs> brave husband. I would never. our stateroom we hung out at the pool deck for a little while I did the slide just saw that it was a good time but uh, then it was time for miles to nap so we headed back to the room got him to take a nap and kind of relax a little bit move some footage around um, just did you know administration ad ad admin stuff anyway uh, now we're gonna actually head to deck five and check out the I guess it's like the onboard daycare. I kind of forget what it's called. I'm sure that'll get input here. It's the Splash Academy. Yeah, Splash Academy, they, that's right. They have times for under threes to play with their parents. Yeah, so 
at least on this particular sailing, they have kind of like open play times for the little kitties to play with their parents and everything. So we're gonna go check that out before we head to Teppanyaki for dinner with the family. Uh, we're not gonna do a ton of filming in there just in case there's other kids out of respect for you know, them and their families and everything, but we'll catch up with you after. Well, there you go. Splash Academy, Guppy's Playroom. I made a friend. <laughs> oh boy, just brought you every toy in that whole room, dude. Yeah. That was adorable. That's these now. But yeah, it was, it was sweet. Uh, now but, time uh, for dinner. Yeah, yeah, hibachi and things. Hibachi and things. It's the and things I'm excited for. We thought this was a nice hibachi experience and coming in at $59 per person if you're paying out of pocket, it was a good use for our free specialty dining credit that we got with the free at sea package. Now, since we had a surprise second sea day back to back, I'm going to just go right into that day and make it all one video for you. Here we go. Hi, Hi friends. friends. Another morning on the ship <laughs> but luckily we're not stuck somewhere we're on a ship that has a lot to do yeah it's a big ship there's a lot of stuff here i want to mini golf today let's do it we're gonna mini golf today and we're also gonna eat because that's what we do mm -hmm. you know if you know this happy place you know we eat so make sure you're subscribed because we will be in bermuda next week <laughs> for next week's video tomorrow for us uh... let's go to breakfast <gasps> all right Today I went with the sausage and or sausage gravy and biscuit because I mean yeah, just you can't pass it up, you know. 
and the grilled tomato, a mushroom and cheese omelet, as well as some bacon. I thought I'd try some cheese and cold cuts today with a soft roll and uh, an orange just so I can say I did something healthy today because it's only going to go downhill from here. Miles is having... Um, He's having potatoes and watermelon and he loves the blueberry muffins. Excellent. Yogurt, yeah. eggs. Yeah, not he so doesn't much. like the soggy so eggs, eggs just like his mom. But. Yeah. Dig in. Good spin. <laughs> My breakfast plate. We got a little bit of everything. Bacon, potatoes, runny eggs. You know how I feel about that. A pecan bun, sticky bun, croissant, a lemon pastry, a lemon cross, uh, uh, what are those called? Danish. Danish is the word I'm looking for. And cantaloupe. And a big thing of ice to put in my water bottle. I think we better clarify for the people that Taylor defines any eggs that aren't burnt as well. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. So I like my eggs burnt. <laughs> don't look at those solid eggs and think those aren't runny. Runny. <gasps> It's mini golf time. Taylor is already getting really antsy and competitive, so this can only go one way. Tell us how you feel, Tay. Oh god. Alright. <laughs> I'm not sure. There's no scorecards. Where did I say I won? Yeah, let's do that. It's better that way. <laughs> All right, so Miles is taking a nap with the grandparents. It means we get a chance to just kind of walk around the ship and reminisce because it really is just so similar to the Encore, but there's some little quirky differences. We decided to take a trip back to the back of Deck 8, which if you remember from the end of our NCL Alaska vlogs, this is where uh, our end car left off at the beautiful sunset. And while we have a little bit of a storm going, let me tell you, the water today is just so blue. Ah, it's beautiful, folks. Take a look at this. Would you just look at it? Would you just look at it? Would you just look at it? It is nice being out here. Find those areas that there's not a lot of people. It feels super cool. It's a big shipping ship out on the horizon. I think they just call those ships. Okay. Hey. Okay, yeah. of a lunch menu. I don't know if it's the same every day, but this is what it is today. Got some desserts down there. This lunch was so 
so good. We had everything from Vietnamese pho to caprese salad, Asian meatball sliders, and the main courses ranged from chicken parm to a Cuban rotisserie chicken and fish tacos. And then we had, I think, all of the desserts and we all loved them and ate every single bite even though we were completely full. I think we would have gone back to taste and savor for more lunches if we didn't have a baby with us. It's just harder to keep them entertained for those longer meals, but we were incredibly impressed with this lunch and definitely recommend it. Taylor. Yeah. You just had lunch at Norwegian Joy's that was taste. taste. Yeah. It was so good. Oh yeah. I think the food has been really, really good on this trip. Everything has been really delicious and the quality is good and I am super happy with <laughs> Miles loves this room. He loves the ceiling here. I mean that's pretty distracting to sit. But yeah, it's really good. So like don't pass up lunch in the main dining areas because the buffet, like it took about an hour, so it's longer, but it was really yummy. Oh yeah. All right, uh, Okay, well, tried to book racing for today, but as one might expect, an unexpected sea day has resulted in everybody wanting to book racing, so the only remaining time slot was on the last day, so we no, got no, no, that. No, they had a time slot tonight, but it was at 6.30, we have a baby. Like, yeah, on yeah. a normal time, that would work if we didn't the have him. The only time but... slot that worked for our party of seven, <laughs> uh, yeah. and all of our requirements was the last day, so we're gonna do that on the last sea day. Yeah, if you definitely 100% wanna do this, like, at a certain time, just come the first day, you're on board, book it for that time, but, there is some flexibility. If you come early in the morning, there's probably more availability, but we have a large party, which makes it harder too. But yeah, no big deal. We'll do it in a couple of days. So subscribe to see us race. Because I'm going to win. <laughs> I believe in you. I'm not going to win. I'm going to just go. You're going to putter along. <laughs> oh, look at that. Look at that over there. Oh, oh my just God. stop in the middle of the racetrack. Oh, oh. Sightseeing. So it does look like when they start a new group, they give you a learner lap first to kind of get yourself figured out before the real racing starts. Which is reassuring because... I'm a great driver. No, you are a great driver. It's just, you know, you've never driven an electric go-kart on a track suspended 17 stories above the ocean before. I don't want to do it. Cancel my reservation. <laughs> Ooh, and they're off, I think, maybe. We are back at the buffet. It's a few hours later. We had a nice nap with Miles and decided just to come to the buffet tonight. They open at five, which is his dinner time. Makes it a little bit easier. Assortment of things. We'll show you what we got. We got, uh, we stopped at the mojito bar. Got some mojitos to enjoy with dinner. And yeah, the assortment here is really nice. The Asian food looks really good, which I think is what I'm gonna aim for. And Miles got pasta. With a honey glazed pork, a barbecue beef melt on the half bun, because I'm not a fatty. That's how they were served. <laughs> I know. <laughs> and uh, a Thai style fish, which I think is going to be very spicy. Oh, I'm, I'm gonna try that. Too. Looking forward to that. Just a couple pieces of like a curried lamb from Taste of India. So tonight it's interesting they have Taste of Asia and Taste of India. So the two sides are different. I found that interesting. And a little bit of vegetable linguine, some fried veggies. Because I'm starting to get a little bit of the vacation stomach. I'm feeling low Okay. I went with a bit of an Asian ensemble. 
have these onion fritters Jake told me to get. Lots of the Indian food. Things that I don't know what they're pronounced. Some okra. Also got some just broccoli and cauliflower gratin. And then some lo mein and some Thai fish. It all looks good. All right. Dinner was good. Buffet dinner. Good quality. Everything tastes delicious. Jake is staying back in the room with Miles to put him to bed. And I am going to see some nightlife. So let's see what I can get into tonight. The waves have definitely picked up. I wasn't able to film the comedy show. There was no filming in there, but apparently at the Beatles show, you can film them. Well, yeah, I mean, we've all heard the Beatles songs, so. True, I guess you can't really new. steal anything from them, but it was family friendly comedy, so, you know, it's all right. They were, there was some funny stuff. That's the end of our day. We're gonna spend time on our balcony, have some wine. It's down there. And, Get ready for tomorrow, because we're finally getting off the ship tomorrow. They say the storm has passed Bermuda, so... It is time for us to see a beach for the first time in many years. Woo. Make sure you're subscribed, because you don't want to miss that. And like this video. Hope you got to see a little bit of the joy. And we'll show you more of it tomorrow night. And our last day at sea the day after. So we'll see you then. And until then, stay, stay magical. magical. We oh. <laughs> Hi friends, good morning. We're heading to breakfast. Gonna hit the buffet. Yeah. Oh, okay. that's what Miles wants you to add. Okay. Stole my bacon. Kid stole my bacon. Hey, also, man. his swim trunks might be a little bit too small. Wow. Boy's wearing a banana hammock over here. It's fine. It's fine. The ocean. The ocean. The ocean. The ocean. No! 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 That was, I don't think I got it bouncing out, but that was so disheartening to watch. Yay! Yeah. Really? So relaxing.